Welcome, my name is Steve Baker. Today I'm going to show you how to capture images in a multi-bay configuration using the ViewIP VCAP module. This is a very easy process. It's only adding one more step if you have a single bay to your location. So let's go ahead and log in with the credentials your service manager has provided you. Once you've logged in, you're going to be taken to the montage view. That'll show all the cameras that you have at one time. To select a specific set of cameras, go to the top left where it says group. Click on that box and select one of the pre-configured groups. Once you have that, all you have to do then is just click on the snapshot button right there in the middle, right above the images. And that'll save the images to the DVR system. But before you do that, I'd recommend putting in a reference number, and I would recommend using the account number, the, the customer's name, and the date, just to be as specific as you can as possible. And then any notes that are in reference to those images. Let's say there was a damage to the right front wheel, damage to the roof. Just be as specific as you can. The more detail you have, the easier it is to look for images, the damage that's in those images. Once you've done that, go back up to the top left and click on the little floppy disk and that'll save the images to the system and now you're in the snapshot view. If you ever need to come back and look for uh, stored images, this is where you'd go to the snapshot. And now to save the images, click on that one image that you just saved and it brings all four of them up. And if you want to, you can right click and save to your desk just one image at a time, choosing the one image that you want. Or you can come up to the top left and there's a download option right there. Click on that. That'll actually zip up all the files. It names it as a default uh, naming convention on the file. Once you save it, I'd recommend and go back and rename that zip file to what your customer's name you put into the reference so it'll be easily correlated between the snapshot and what you've downloaded. And after that, that's it. That's all you have to do to capture images in a multi-bay location. If you have any more questions or comments, we'd look forward to hearing from you. Once again, my name is Steve Baker, and I thank you for your time, and you have a great day.